Oxidation reduction reactions, also known as redox reactions, involve the transfer of electrons between chemical substances. In simpler terms, one substance loses electrons, while another gains them. These reactions are fundamental to many chemical processes, including those in everyday life and industrial applications. Let's first discuss, distinguish between oxidation and reduction. Point number one. According to classical concept, in terms of hydrogen transfer, oxidation is the loss or removal of hydrogen. Example, magnesium reacts with hydrochloric acid in single displacement reaction to produce magnesium chloride salt and hydrogen gas. In this reaction hydrogen is removed from HCl. Hence, it is an oxidation with respect to HCl. Reduction is the gain or addition of hydrogen. Example, the elements hydrogen and sulfur can react to form hydrogen sulfide, also known as hydrosulfuric acid. In this reaction, hydrogen is added to sulfur. Hence, it is reduction with respect to sulfur. Point number two. According to classical concept, in terms of oxygen transfer, oxidation is the gain or addition of oxygen. Example metals like magnesium, iron, copper, combine readily with oxygen to form corresponding oxides. Reduction is the loss or removal of oxygen. Example, catalytic reduction of carbon dioxide by hydrogen for synthesis of carbon monoxide. In this reaction, oxygen is removed from carbon dioxide. Hence, it is reduction with respect to carbon dioxide. Point number three. Oxidation is the addition of electronegative element. Example, addition of electronegative chlorine to stannous chloride to form stannic chloride. Reduction is the addition of electropositive element. Example, addition of electropositive copper to chlorine to form cupric chloride. Point number four. Oxidation is the removal of electropositive element. Example. Potassium iodide reacts with hydrogen peroxide to form potassium hydroxide and iodine. In this reaction electropositive element, potassium, is removed from potassium iodide. Reduction is the removal of electronegative element. Example, the reaction between aluminium chloride and sodium. It is a single replacement reaction. In this reaction, sodium replaces aluminium, forming sodium chloride and elemental aluminium. In this reaction, electronegative element, chlorine is removed from aluminium chloride. Point number five. According to electronic concept, Oxidation is a process, which involves, loss of one or more electrons, by an atom, ion, or, group of atoms. Thus, oxidation is, de-electronation. As a result of loss of electron, there is increase in positive charge, or, decrease in negative charge, of, atom, ion or group of atoms, undergoing oxidation. In following examples, sodium atom, Sn2 plus ion, H2 molecule, and, Cl- ion undergo oxidation. According to electronic concept, reduction is a process, which involves, gain of one or more electrons, by an atom, ion, or, group of atoms. Thus, reduction is, electronation. As a result of gain of electrons, there is increase in negative charge, or, decrease in positive charge, of, an atom, ion, or, group of atoms, undergoing reduction. In following examples, sulfur atom, Fe, 3 plus ion, MnO4 minus ion, and Cl2 molecule undergo reduction. Point number six. Oxidation and reduction, in terms of oxidation number or oxidation state. In oxidation reaction, oxidation number of an element increases due to increase in positive charge. In reduction reaction, oxidation number of an element decreases due to decrease in positive charge. Example. When zinc is added to copper sulfate solution, a displacement reaction occurs. 
Zinc, being more reactive than copper, displaces copper, from copper sulfate solution, forming zinc sulfate, and, depositing copper metal. The reaction between zinc and copper sulfate is a redox reaction. In this reaction zinc is oxidized. It undergoes loss of electrons. Oxidation number of zinc increases from 0, to, plus 2. In this copper ions are reduced. They undergo gain of electrons. Oxidation number of copper decreases from plus 2, to, 0. Let's see what is redox reaction. The reactions in which, oxidation and reduction, take place simultaneously, are called as redox reactions. Every redox reaction is composed of two half reactions. One, oxidation half reaction, in which, electrons are lost. Two, reduction half reaction, in which, electrons are gained. In redox reactions, number of electrons gain, is always equal to, number of electrons lost. Redox reactions are all around us, the burning of fuels, the corrosion of metals, the processes of photosynthesis, cellular respiration, etc. involve oxidation and reduction. Some examples of common redox reactions, are combustion of methane, oxidation of copper, photosynthesis, etc. shown below.